Hello everybody, this is James from TechPopper.com and in this video I will be teaching you how to wipe your hard drives completely using a free program called Derek's Boot Nuke. There are many reasons one would wish to wipe their own hard drive. For example, if you're looking to sell your computer to a stranger, it would be a very good idea to do so. Far too many people find out after selling their PC that their credit card coincidentally gets stolen soon afterwards, and I'm sure we can all guess why. Wiping your hard drive is something everyone should do before selling their computer. However, doing so to prank a friend is not. That can upset them greatly. Fortunately, wiping a hard drive completely is very quick and easy. First, navigate to a website called dban.org. As you can see here, I already have it loaded up. Click the download section and you'll be redirected to SourceForge where your .iso file will be downloaded which you can see right here SourceForge okay that will start downloading after that all you need to do is simply burn the ISO to a DVD because this is an ISO you, you have, that you have to boot off of it should be on a DVD instead of a USB flash drive because a lot of USB flash drives you can't boot off of when you have the ISO file burned to a disk, put it in your computer and power it off. Restart and go into your system BIOS. Later I will have another video showing you how to do that, but you can just Google it for right now if I don't have it up yet. Look around to where you look around until you find where you can change the boot sequence. This is a lot easier if you have a UEFI BIOS, but it's still easy if you have normal ones. I would recommend not changing anything else unless you know what you're doing. It's not really necessary for this and it could potentially damage your computer if you mess with the wrong stuff. When you find the boot sequence order, change it so the drive with the Derek's boot nuke ISO is, is the first priority. It sh when you reboot up your computer, it should load the ISO and launch Derek's boot nuke. Choose whichever nuking option you like and run it. It would remove anything off any of your selected drives. It may take some time, so be patient. Once it's finished, you su su successfully wiped your hard drive. My apologies for that. If you don't have a DVD burner, you can get them really cheap. External, $21 or $22 on Newegg. Internal, they're a bit cheaper. And your computer will still detect it, and you can still boot off of it, even if it's an external drive, so you don't have to worry about that. Um... That's about it for instructions. Here are some frequently asked questions about Derek's boot nuke. Will my computer be dead after using this? No, you will still be able to access your motherboard system BIOS, which is enough to be able to reinstall your operating system and anything else. Your computer will still be completely usable, and I'd recommend reinstalling an operating system before you sell it. People you sell it to will not want to have to do that themselves. Does this wipe the operating system? Yes, it wipes everything. Since your boot BIOS sequence is already set to run from your DVD drive first, just put in your operating system, install CD, and run it. It will reinstall your operating system. Does this work on Mac computers? Yes. When booting up your computer, hold down the C key on Macs to boot from a disk. Do the same while re when reinstalling your operating system. I have Windows 98 or another extremely old operating system. Can I still run this? Yes, this can run on any operating system. The motherboard BIOS of your computer controls the boot sequence. The operating system has nothing to do with it. Alright, well that about wraps it up. If you found this video helpful, please like, favorite, or subscribe. If you have any questions, post them in a comment. I will try to reply as soon as I can. Thanks for watching.